Hey guys, what's up? Milk Choco King here, back with another video. Today we are going to be talking about what is the worst helmet in Milk Choco and what is the best helmet in Milk Choco. Now, of course, this is my opinion. You may have a different opinion, but I'm just going to give you guys my opinion today on what is the best helmet and what is the worst helmet in Milk Choco. And so before we get into it, make sure to subscribe to the channel, turn on post notifications so you get notified every single time I upload some more awesome content. Doing those both would make me really happy. So yeah, let's get on with it. All right, the worst helmet in the game, in my opinion, is the launcher. Now the launcher is, it's not that good. It is, it's, it's doo-doo. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's just not that great of a helmet, to be honest, and I've never been a fan of it, really, and you may have different opinions. Some of you guys may love the launcher. Some of you guys may hate the launcher. Honestly, this helmet just sucks, and I'm going to go ahead and put some bots on the different team, and we're going to go ahead and play with the launcher, just to show you guys why it's not that great of a helmet, and we're going to go ahead... And we're gonna try to pick the best map for the launcher. And let's go ahead and do this assault map. The launcher, this is probably the best map for the launcher. Cause the cause that little hole in the ground, the thing that you're supposed to pump the chocolate milk or whatever in. You can launch your launch. I'm very confused right now. Launch your launch pad into there. And you have a high chance of killing someone, but. On other maps, it really doesn't work. Yeah, so right off the bat, you can see the launcher is a very, very slow helmet. It is not fast at all. And that is one of the things that I like about helmets. I want a good, fast helmet, and this helmet is not fast at all. It's very slow. On the other hand, it can throw a grenade very far. But sometimes I don't like my grenades getting thrown very far because sometimes it will throw them too far. And that is something like, boom. And this is, see, that is very far. That is very good. Oh my gosh. I fell off the map. I'm very sorry for that, guys. Yep. I'm so bad at the game. Still have a fractured arm and I'm getting my cast off in about six days. So that is good. But anyways... Yeah, it's very slow helmet, very slow. But, and the launch pad, I believe, only does 150 damage. So let's go ahead and launch something in there. Yeah, it doesn't kill anyone. And it takes forever for you to launch it. And there we go. And Choco win. Yeah, that is just like... It's just... Very slow helmet, grenade, not terrible, but sometimes you may throw it too far, but you know, it's just not good. And when you do, when you are like launching, like, let me demonstrate, like the launch pad, it's very easy to escape because the launcher runs faster than the launch pad expands. Like, and that's the thing, it's just... Not that great of a helmet. Really easy to escape the launch pad. Grenade, decent, speed, awful. Yeah, it's just, it's not worth buying, really. Honestly, I really don't, since I bought the helmet, I think the helmet is around 880 coins. I may be incorrect. I may be correct. Uh, I have no clue. But, there it is, launcher. Not a great helmet in my opinion. I will, you guys rarely see me wearing the helmet. And yeah, I just, I'm not a big fan of the helmet. But anyways, what is the best helmet in Milk Choco? This is my opinion again. And the helmet I think is the best in Milk Choco is the blade helmet. The blade helmet is an absolute savage helmet. Let's go ahead and get into it. And all the gameplay is going to be in friendly. Please do not get mad at me for that. So I can just demonstrate of how good the helmet is. 
The blade is an absolute beast helmet. And I have no clue what map to do with that. The blade is just a really good helmet. Its power is you gotta wait for it to get recharged and everything. It is a fast running helmet, really good. Good fast running helmet. Grenade. I don't mind short throw grenades. That's my, I don't care. It's not terrible, but like 200 damage, really good, and I got killed. I, I it's my personal opinion. I think the blade is a pretty good helmet. And like if you like run into like an invisible or another blade helmet, which they only have 165 health. You can just one hit them with your power. And that is something. But any other helmets, I think they have higher health. So just blade them, turn around, pop, and shoot them. And they should die. Depends on what weapon you are using. Like that. And like that. Oh crap. Hang on, guys. Give me one second. Let me move this all the way down here. Oh no. <laughs> really sorry for the gameplay that it may not be as good. Alright. Hang on, let's let me, let me respawn real quick. I don't know. I mean, this is just, I love using this helmet a lot. Like, you know, it's just a really great helmet. And just, it's just, and especially, I love this thing about the blade is that when you kill someone, your power is immediately recharged back. See, look, immediately have the power back, and that is something, and you can get almost, like, unlimited kills, like, you could just have, like, people just lined up right here, if they, look, if they were all low, you would kill them all, like, and you just bladed, you would kill them all, and that's something I really, that's really cool about this helmet. Yeah, you know, it's fast, I've already said that, it's a very fast running helmet, and as I said, the grenade throw, I don't mind slow grenades, as I said that already. It's, it's not terrible, in my opinion. No, you get up close and you, and you just you can just throw the grenade. Like get them low, and then bam, kill them. And that is just it's a really good helmet. Like you just shoot him, bam, and he got me. Anyway, you know, I totally recommend getting the blade helmet. It is a very good helmet. For only the price, it's it's around 2,000 coins, I know. Even though it is one of the more expensive helmets, it is definitely worth the price it is. So yeah, that is basically all for this video, folks. Anyway, if you really, if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel, leave post notifications on. And if you did enjoy the video, leave a like on the video. Doing all those three things would really make my day and anyways, oh, before we go, my upload schedule is going to be changing and it's going to be around, a v I don't know, it's not going to be every other, it's probably going to be every other day there'll be another upload. Yeah, it's going to be my new upload schedule. It's just too tough to get an upload out every single day. So yeah, tomorrow I'll be working on a video. But I don't know if I'll post it. I'll try. But anyways, again, subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications. Leave a like on the video. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.